Oh, Durst is the worst. Ah! Durst the worst, bitch! <laughs> Durst the worst, bitch! Durst the worst, bitch! Durst the worst, bitch! Now I would like to introduce our next speaker. Who is from Progressive Moms of Wisconsin, Emily Sean Fender? Hello. Thank you, everybody, for coming today. Um, if you can't hear me, just yell. Okay. Um, I'm here today as a mom. I'm a mom of four children, um, and I'm a foster parent. I've fostered more children um, in our city. I'm here because I'm outraged and I'm heartbroken at the treatment of children in these camps. I don't care what you call them. I really don't. This week, my kids are at summer camps. That's where kids are supposed to be. Yeah. Oh, yeah. While my kids are at summer camps, other mothers have children in cages. While I am convincing my kids to take a bath after playing outside, other children don't have soap or toothpaste or a shower. They haven't been bathed in weeks or months. While I am putting my kids to bed, other children don't have a bed to sleep on. They don't have a blanket. They don't have anybody there to, get, to kiss them goodnight. These are children, just like our children, different only in the luck and location of their birth, and to our government, the color of their skin. As a foster parent, I have been trained well in what our government considers to be safe and adequate care of children. If I did even half of what our government is doing to these children, my children would be taken away because my government yes, knows. Yes, yes, they know right. clearly that this is abuse yep. and neglect. Yes. Yes. What we are doing to these little ones is damaging and long lasting. Yes. Attachment disorders are extremely difficult to repair. We are doing lifelong harm yes. as a campaign strategy yes. for a cruel administration. Yes. yes, it is. As a mother, I can tell you that I would fight to my last breath for the safety and security of my children. That's why refugee families come here. They are fighting for the lives of their children. They are us, and we are them. Their children are our children. We are the same way. We need to fight for these families as if they were our own. We need to tear down these camps as if our children were inside yes. them. Yeah. But that means that the board is our responsibility now from this day. We can't vote this away. I have made calls and so have you. I have called and I have called. Children cannot endure month after month after month of this as we wait for a 2020 election. Yes. Yes. We are committed, and I need every one of you to be committed to doing whatever it takes to release every single one of these children and re re reunite them with their families. Thank you. You try, bitch.